The Tigers today are completely unchanged in their starting 11. All sopping goals, Slater, Jones, Greaves and Jacob across the back. And Moore, Morton, Seri and Philogene with Tufan and Cavalier completing the 11 today for the Tigers. Christy Coyle, Delap, Doherty, Giles, Ingram on the bench, no Pando today, McLaughlin, Sharp and Traore. So Connolly misses out altogether as well. Liam Rossini alluded to the fact that there might be one or two players carrying knocks. Could that be that Aaron Connolly has failed a fitness test perhaps? Coyle has passed the assessment and will at least be on the bench today. Irma, touching field, gets a bit fortunate because the space is open. Tufan, a touch away from Kayembe. City playing at pace. Carvalho into the area on the right-hand side. Gets trips in the area, it's a penalty! And Carvalho knew it was a penalty straight away. At one end, Morton times it perfectly. At the other, Watford gets it wrong. As Tufan then, big puff of the chest, up he steps, saved by Backman! Massive cheers from the Watford fans. And Ozan Tufan on his return to Vicarage Road misses the penalty. He angled it to the right-hand side, Backman dives across, not fully in the corner, remains nil-nil. Ball's back with Kone, working it wide now towards Dennis, Lewis, ball into the area, Jacob's got to get there, free header in the box for a spree at, but headed wide of goal, it was from about nine yards, big chance then for Watford, the first one they've really conjured up. Two fan in the six yard box, three waiting on the penalty spot, Carvalho and Seri on the edges, in it comes, looking for Jones, and it lands at the feet of two fan, tries to back heel it from a couple of yards out, and Backman was in the way, right on his goal line, Two fan denied again. I don't think the Tigers fans realised how close that was at the other end. Carvalho then wants to rise and get the touch away from Coney. Wesley Hoots ball in, angled out by Jones, comes to Coney on the edges, sets it up for Kayembe. Low shot driving right. Going to be a corner. Tigers fans don't like it, they feel it was a goal kick. There's not much complaint from those in blue on the pitch as Kayembe took the shot on. Matty Jacob looking for a short option from the uh, free kick. Carvalho collides with Turner. Play goes on. Tufan in behind the defence. He's tucked it into the net, but the flag's up for offside. And it went up a while ago. And uh, Ben Turner having a little apology and a hug with Carvalho. A smile on his face. Tufan was offside. As Carvalho loses possession and... Uh, now it's the hand on head as Watford look to break. Aspria now at pace. Morton holding on to his feet. Aspria 18 yards out right in the middle. Plays it to Dennis. Big tackle. What a tackle from young Matty Jacob. Six yards out. Throws himself in front of the man to deny Aspria. Aspria into the box. Low ball in. Seri gets a touch. Slater's going to try and keep it away. Allsop's come out. Suddenly Dennis didn't see that he was off his line, Aspria now trying to cross in towards the back of the area, kept alive, Andrews with the shot, on the half volley, wide of goal. Slater was trying to keep it in play, there was a lapse in concentration, bit of communication maybe as well. Porteous in front of the wall, Allsop on his line, Ryevich, it was venomous and Allsop got himself positioned well, beats it away. Tom cleverly calling for calm on that near side technical area. Hoot gets away from Irma, ball into the box, comes off the thigh of Jones. Slater bringing it under control, Morton now to Irma. Hull City will have to get from one end of the pitch to the other if they're to craft something from this move. And Slater picks out Jacob, and he has got space to run into here. Matty Jacob goes into the Watford half, Philogene to his left. Philogene now dragging the ball in field, stays on his feet, a ball to Delap in the box, Liam Delap goes wide of goal. And Delap was caught just by the last ditch defending of Wesley Hoot, but dragged wide of the goal. That might have been one of the goals of the season for the fact Hull City worked it completely from back to front. Everyone in a Watford shirt back in the penalty area. Hull City have four, make it five in the box, ready to get on the rebound if Backman beats it into a dangerous area. Carvalho and Morton over it. Carvalho 
is going to hit it right footed and Backman with a big save tipping it away from the top right hand corner Carvalho did his bit but Backman with international quality denies him ball lands with Martins Carvalho doesn't go in for a challenge Martins with a ball angled right good ball it is as well and Gakia trying to join in the fun comes to Matthew Martins it's gone wide of goal 10 yards out he's managed to side foot it away from where he was that was his far post right hand side big opportunity gone for Watford Morton gets it on the floor De Lapp in a pocket right down the middle De Lapp trying to twist and turn his way through gets shoved over ball comes to Carvalho Philogene in the box Carvalho Sandwich between two and yellow, comes out to Matty Jacob! Oh, it's pushed by Backman, is Sharp going to get there? He makes a good double save in the six-yard box. Well, City have scored stoppage time goals this season. As Morton gives it a long ball forward and Greaves suddenly is away. Jacob Greaves into the penalty area, massive moment! Greaves, what a save by Backman! And then Backman goes over from colliding with Traore. And De Lapp has verbals as well. Traore gets a yellow card. Oh, it just needed to be the other way around. It needed to be an attack, even though Greaves has scored goals this season. He was clean through, drifting left. Couldn't pick out a corner. Good goalkeeping again from Backman.